Welcome back to Propo Reacts. It's been a while and I am so excited today to do my next reaction on Big Bang's new comeback, Still Life. The Korean title actually is Bom Yonam Gao Gyo, which literally means spring, summer, fall, winter. Unlike most reacts, we are not going to be watching the entire music video because I figured most people don't want to see me do that. Uh, if you actually want to see my full reaction watching the music video, let me know and I will start doing that again. Otherwise, I'm just going to give you some of my thoughts and go various parts of the music video show in case in that. So first off, Still Life, this feels like a goodbye, a song before moving on. It's a love letter to the past before moving to the future, but also a love letter to the fans, the VIPs, which is what Big Bang fans are called. Um, why do I think that? Well, the instrumentals. I really love them, real instruments, uh, but you'll notice that the instrumentals are very subdued and they have a very sentimental feel to them, coupled with their vocals. Um, I'm going to go through some more reasons, but one of them is the theme of seasons. The seasons show the progression of life, a journey, and they cover in this song all four. So it's almost like covering a life, and it's point in their life where they want to move on. The life of Big Bang, the cycle of Big Bang's life progression has already gone through spring, summer, fall, winter. And now it's time for them to have their own rebirth as individual members. To have their own new spring, summers, falls, and winters. So throughout the lyrics, you'll notice when you watch a music video yourself, or the song, or listen to the song, is that you will notice all this talk about seasons, about the past, about moving on, about goodbyes. It comes up a lot, so there's a lot of hints to it. Um, we can go through right now. Part of the refrain. Comes again. Talk about cycle. Goodbye now to my beloved young days. Talk about goodbye to the past. Here it comes. After the rain, instead of sadness, it's a happy end. Talking about this while this goodbye, it's not to be sad, it's for new growth, new beginnings. Talking about rainbow. Walk through the force to move. Talking about the past. Pretty, um, a lot of reflection going on. But you see where Top Talks just wraps right there. Risking his life to start anew. Round trip ship running. They've already come back to the start. It's time to move on. Here's a really interesting point though. Is what we're going to get. It's right here. Top turns around. Takes off his mask. And then turns around. And here's why this is really huge to me, I think. It's a symbolism. Is that during his heyday, uh, you could say Top has a role, a uh, persona he has to exhibit. Now, it's similar to personality, yes, but it's persona. You'll see this a lot in Korean variety shows as well. A character they play. And so he does a lot of raps. He does a lot of crazy outfits. Not all of Big Bang does. Uh, but sometimes he wears masks and stuff with his raps. And this shows, this is like him his heyday. What his persona, his music has been for Big Bang. But at the end, he turns around, takes off the mask, saying it's time to throw this facade away. It's time for me to do new things. And he turns around with his face, just stares camera. It's like his goodbye. It's like, this is it. I'm done. Um, now, you have to understand is that he, his YG contract is up. He's still going to be doing Big Bang activities when he can. It's sort of like Tech Young from 2 p.m. doing with 2 p.m. stuff. But Top said in an interview, that the music of Big Bang is different now, and what he wants to do musically is different. So it's a natural uh, goodbye for him, that he wants to move on, and this sort of visually shows that. Now there's another, <clears throat> now to our next point, is that we're going to go to this nice visual cue of the four empty chairs. Now we watched the music video earlier, uh, one member sits on, I think it was this song, 
where there's four chairs. If I can find it. That's the question. Can I find, I feel like I'm too far. But there is a shot of two, four chairs. It's a quick shot, so. Wow, there it is. That shot. That shot with the four chairs. Four chairs for the four members of Big Bang left. All empty. Which comes to my next point. If you watch the full music video, you will notice none of the members are together. You know, a lot of Big Bang music videos, at least for the chorus, they'll be all together or twos and duos will be together. This music video, they are never together. They are all solo shots, all solo acts in their own scenes. They never come together, which is sort of showing the end of Big Bang in some ways, I think, going their own paths. Now, I'll, I'll take a moment to get to that right now. And you say, well, Big Bang still exists. Yes, they will exist. But Big Bang as we know it now, as a four-member group, all with YG, back, like, it's gone. You know, what I see maybe is something like we have with Girls' Generation where they did a subgroup. It's going to be a subgroup, maybe. Or maybe they don't even do any new Big Bang stuff. I don't know what YG has in store for Big Bang as a group. You know? Maybe they just have them under contract and they retire and disband Big Bang, but they have different members under contract and let them do just solo stuff. Who knows? I have no idea. But as this moment, as Big Bang is a collective four member group, it's done. But like Top is still going to do Big Bang activities, but you know what I mean. It, this seems like a marking of an end, which is why this visual um, cues are really, really cool. Um, a little sad but cool nonetheless and my last point I want to focus is on this last refrain back to talk about it does so much about seasons you know as I talked about earlier about the cycle so a cycle of Big Bang's life and then this end boom it's so abrupt. It's not crazy abrupt where it's like, what? The song's ended? But like, Taeyong finishes the vocals and then whoosh, the song ends. Vroom. Some, you know, like some songs, they do a lot more fade out than instrumentals, but just feels like, just how the song ends feels like the end, that it is over now. This is it. Oh, it gives me goosebumps. You know, this is definitely to me feels like a love letter to fans saying, we want to move on. We appreciate you, we love you, but it's time for the Big Bang members to do bigger and greater things. And I accept it. It's like the end of a journey. Um, you could compare it to like Lord of the Rings, like in the movies and the books where the hobbits all get together and then the hobbits all go off and do their own things. Merry and Pippin do their own thing, Sam does their own thing, Frodo does his own thing. That's what this feels like. It's the fellowship of Big Bang going off, doing great things, but on their own or in different groups. But, um, <clears throat> you know, it sort of sucks because this is, feels like the end. You know, we waited five years for another single, you know. Not that I'm begrudging or anything. And I was, like, hoping we'd get, like, a mini album maybe. Like, so we get a little more of Heyday, something similar to Bang 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 or Lies or something, you know. Remind us of the Heyday of Big Bang. But this is very much like 21's ending, uh, closing single comeback. So... I think theirs was called goodbye actually and this feels like a goodbye from big bang as well but you know i'm very happy to have been a big bang fan all the way back and like 2007 when i heard lies way way back and this marks the end of an era like second gen has been over but the song this ending for big bang essentially it's like truly the end like it is you know Technically, there's some second gen groups that are sometimes active or come back, but this was a behemoth of second gen, and they're basically giving us their unofficial goodbye. So, 
sad, but I'm happy for Big Bang, Big Bang for them. Excited for what the individual members are going to be doing with their careers now. GD, top. Uh, Daesong, I don't know, Daesong does too much, and Taeyong. Let's, I want to see what they do as soloists, you know? But always going to love and remember Big Bang, and it's sad that they're now done, essentially. But happy they gave us this last final song for all of us to remember and to be with them for. Thank you so much for listening to my ramblings of Propo Reacts. This one has been a touching one since it's a group close to my heart and it feels like their final song. Um, if you liked it, please like. If you're interested in Korean pop culture, React videos, etc., please subscribe. Uh, I will be doing more at some point. I'm trying to vary my content up, so leave a comment below also of what you want to see. Do you like seeing these reactions? Do you like to see it more like I did this time where it's more spot reactions or do you want to see a full uninterrupt, uninterrupt, uninterrupted reaction from start to finish of a full music video that sort of thing do you want me to see do variety shows or whatever go away just not from just k-pop let me know thanks so much and until next time i will bid you adieu be sure to check me out on my other socials such as discord facebook twitch and twitter thanks see you next time